Alright, hey guys, welcome back to another video. So today we have another final ver uh, official version of my texture pack. So as you all know, um, a little while back I was, I created a texture pack called Withered, Withered Dungeon, and uh, there's two versions of it. I decided I, uh, I didn't like it as much and I didn't use it, so now I'm using this texture pack. Um, so it is now called Withered V3. So this is Withered V3. If we go up, um, it's, yeah. So, it just fill this back in. So basically what happened, uh, so the last couple days I've just been working on this texture pack. So, and today I'm going to show you all of it today. Alright, so if we walk up to this desert temple, we can see that there is a beacon. That doesn't matter, I just put that there for reasons. Uh, so we have these, which haven't changed much. The sandstone has changed. The glowstone has changed a lot, which I'm not too sure if I like it. So, uh, later versions, if I don't like it, I'll change it. As well as the sea lantern hasn't changed. The torches and the redstone torches have just changed a tad bit. So, let's... <coughs> sorry, let's walk in. So, we have the red carpet right there, which... It actually looks really nice and smooth, the way that the texture is. So, let's walk in. So, the instant we walked in, we see a lot of stuff. First of all, the bed. Uh, I do have to change that texture, so I will do that in, I think, 3v1, I don't know, 3.1. But if we start here, we can start here. So we have iron blocks, which look pretty nice. We have the diamond blocks, which I have gone to the really nice smooth version. Um, it's this really nice red diamond block. We have the coal, forest emerald, and the gold, and lapis. They all look the same, except for the redstone. Now the redstone, I will change in the future. I'm going to change it to its original texture. So this is just how it is for now. Um, and I put this here just so that it was redstone block and not diamond. So um, if we go here, as we can see, the beacon has an actual texture now. Um, as we can see, if we look down here, we can see that the obsidian has been changed and the side of the beacon has changed, as well as the beacon actually has a texture now. So that's pretty cool. If we go over here, here, we can see a lot of weapons. So if we drop down, we can see that these are the shovels. As you can see, I put like a really like nice like touch to them at the very end. As well as just a really nice smooth color. Um, here are the hoes. And with the diamonds, I put this like blue stick down the middle just to show that it was diamond. Um, now the pickaxes, they really, stu they really stand out the other ones. Now the one that I'm actually really proud of is the axes. These axes look really, really cool. It's diff not only just different, but yeah. If we go up to the armors, the swords, I actually really, really like the design that I put on them. Sorry, just turning down the music. So as we can see, they have the, uh, the end as uh, all the other tools. Um, and of course these, they have the flat end of the sword. They have a flat end, which I'm not, I don't know why it has a flat end, but I just put that there. So it's gonna be great for like combat reasons. So it also does have this, instead of, because with a normal diamond sword, or with this normal sword, normally in the middle it's just all black and just a bit of gray where that red is. So where my cursor is right now, um, that changed. Oh, as I forgot to talk, but the cursor too is. I don't know if I can enlarge that, but I I'm, I don't know if I can enlarge that. But right in the middle of it is um. Yeah, it's really hard to see. It might be easier for you to see in this blue. Yeah, you might be able to see it. I don't know. Um, but it, and of course the glass is really smooth with it just being pure clean. If that's just the perimeter, as well as the glass panes too. It just looks really nice. So if we drop it down here, oh ladders too. The ladders look pretty cool. Drop down here, we can see that the hello. <laughs> we can see that the TNT looks um kind of cool. I do like the side though. That is really cool. And you can also see the cleanness of the glass here. So if we turn around over here. There's nothing to report in there, but here are the ores. So here's the. Why are there bats? What 
whatever. Nether quartz, emerald, gold, iron, coal, lapis, redstone. And of course, same with the diamond blocks. This is, yeah. Uh, I might change it back to its original blue state, but I'm not totally sure if I want to do that yet. If I walk out, we can pull out the bow. And yes, I put the high here just for purposes. So there is different different versions of the bow. Now when the pull, when the bow, uh, here are the arrows by the way. They look really nice and sick. But here's the bow. Um, there's standby, bow standby one, two, and three. Now of course it's one point eight point nine, so it doesn't activate that, which I don't understand why. But yeah. Also, uh, same with the carpets, the wool. It's clean. Get out of here. It is just clean and it looks nice. Going back over here, we can fish. We can see that the fishing rod is. Um, that this is also very clean um, as well. And it is currently broken right now, the fishing rod. Which I don't know why, but yeah. If we walk over here, this is the enchanting setup. Oh, yeah, here's the creative inventory. And the hotbar, you can see. Um, if we drop into here, we grab the diamond armor, and we grab the lapis lazuli. Uh, yeah, I'm breaking three. We can see that the texture for... Let me just enchant the rest. Pro, ooh, prop three and breaking three. Ooh, fire prop three and thorns too. Not bad, not bad, not bad. So, if I enchant all this, you can see that the enchant is really clean. It looks like you have, like, stuff on it, so... I'm just really glad with what I did with that. So, before we go back into survival mode, and you guys can see the survival mode inventory, let's just hop out of here. And let's go out the secret passageway, which is this way. Um, so, as you can see, this is right on the block, so let's, uh, let's look up. And you can see the scenery change. There's day, there's night, and there's day again. We come back out here, grab our boat. We drive down over here. Boats are so weird in 1.8.9. Okay. Now, if we have a stone, and I'm really glad of this. Stone I really like. Um let's just game mode spectator. Um where is the lava pool? Right here. Wait, where's the lava pool that I can actually like, jump into? Ah, right here. Ah, sure. Game mode mode survival. So you can see that the heart is blue and the Hunger bar is blue. If we let it die off a bit, here, um, effect give at p hunger. I don't Minecraft hunger. Uh, so the hearts do turn green, and if I do run around, it's in here. So if I do run around. There we go. So if we give ourselves um Minecraft Poison, the hearts down there. They look pretty cool. We drink this again. And we give ourselves okay. But and then fire. Boom. Boom. So yeah, this is texture pack. This is texture uh, withered. 
also known as Wither Dungeon V3. Hope you guys have enjoyed for this texture hack, and of course in the future there will be different versions of it. Anyways, hope you guys have enjoyed, and I will see you guys next time. Goodbye.